It is undeniable that young people have faced several challenges during the pandemic crisis. They changed their routines to homeschooling, they confronted anxiety and depression, and they have had many of their expectations frustrated. Despite this, many of them learned about resilience, about empathy, and about resistance. Now, we wonder about their expectations for life after COVID-19. We are motivated to figure out what they are expecting about this new normal and what can be done by our local Red Cross Society. Our motivation is to create a platform where young people can express themselves and have their ideas and thoughts heard. Contributing to a future after COVID-19 where young people have an active voice. We'd like to bring people together to chat about their experiences and worries and create something from it. Share it with people, young people and the world. Well, the issue is young people have very limited platform to be able to express the expectation and the aspiration regarding what we commonly call the new normal. Um, they've faced over the past two years challenges that they've never faced before, ranging from isolation, food insecurity, limited access to education and technology. So how are these challenges? have translated into the government program, into this decision boxes program um, towards the COVID response. We think it's crucial to have a way to be able to express this. But our ideas goes a bit further than that. We can start by young people and reach out to often upgrade communities like refugees and minorities who are often excluded from this type of initiatives. So concretely, what's the idea? behind our initiative. What's our vision? Our idea is to want to create an ebook with the testimonials of young people. To create this ebook, we plan on having some sessions and interview with young volunteers to talk about this topic informally. The idea is to establish an atmosphere where they can feel safe and free to talk about what they're expecting from the new normal. Um, how they are doing with the normal and what kind of support they would like to have from our no national society. Posteriorly, based on the conversations, we'll select fragments that will become the content of the ebook, creating a collage of different testimonials and illustrative images collected from the sessions, and sharing all departments that work with young volunteers and to make them aware of their needs and expectations with other young people. <laughs>